Hello everyone, this video will show you how to create a default login with local storage in react.js First I need to save the email id and password in the local storage default I already give a default email id and password Ok, I am going to store that email id and password in the local storage If every time page is opened, uh, it check the local storage and if data is exist in the local storage, it is directly move to the home page otherwise it stay in the login page Ok with logout button I am going to create a form and inside the form I am going to create a div this is input ok for a email id type is text and also I need one more input field for a password I am going to change this text into password and I need one more button one button ok and its name is login and save this yeah button I, I created a button why it's not showing oh sorry button yeah I want to change the inputs field height and width ok I already imported a CSS here this file ok I am going to change the input field height height is 30px yeah this is good width is 25 percentage yeah this is also good I am going to change the button style height is same 30 px and width is 15 percentage and I need to change the input field font size is 18 px and button font size is 20 px save this yeah this is good I am going to start the functionality ok yeah. ok and save this I am going to the login page now I am going to create a on submit and in submit copy this and also I need to create one ref right because I need to get the value from the input field first I create one function for a uh, on submit now I'm going to create a use ref for email and password const email use ref yeah it's imported here okay I need one more for a password and I'm going to copy this and paste it in the email field it's ref paste this this is also ref this is password yeah now I can able to get the value from this email and password okay I already created a handle submit inside this I'm going to give a default value for email and password email dot current dot value now I'm going to check ok it's equal to abc at gmail dot com and I need a password ok both the field are in filled then only it will go to the next step ok password dot current dot value is equal to 12345 this is the password ok if this input field email and password is same this condition will come inside the if condition I'm, I'm going to store the local storage dot set 
I need to give a key for email data emailed email okay and also I am going to give a password as sorry email is this I am going to store this email sorry I didn't copy this paste this and also one more for a password password data and this is 2, 3, 4, 5 and I save this file I inspect this go to application initially I did application is empty here inside the local storage click the HTTP local store local host 3000 because my port number is this this is the react port ok if I type wrong wrong password and email means it won't store the value and if I type correct email id in password dot com and maybe one two three four five and say lo click login button means it will store the data in the local storage okay close this alert and never if I if data is saved I need to navigate to home page okay now I'm going to create a nav home page here already created a home page here I'm going to create a h1 tag and this is home page okay and also I need to create one button for logout and initially I create a function I will give a handle click copy this const and paste this and this is ok and I am going to copy this home page go to this page here I need to get the local storage value to check if the data is exist in the local storage or not ok const get email equal to local storage dot get item its email id ok and also one more for a password and here I'm going to copy this yeah I'm going to create a ternary operator ok and also I need to close after the form inside this inside this I check if get email id and password is exist in the local storage if it is true it's moved to home page ok and close this sorry ok here if email id and password is, is is in the local storage it's go to the navigate to home page otherwise it will be in the same login page ok save this I'm going here and refresh this page yeah it's moved to home page because the data in present in the local storage ok now I'm going to create a logout function ok and going to the home page sorry here I already created a home page sorry handle logout function and inside this I want to clear the local storage local storage dot set item local storage value ok sorry I need to clear local storage and also I need to refresh this page so windows dot local dot reload ok save this and yeah I refresh this page if I click logout means uh, the content will be the local storage value will be 
cleared and it's back to the home page okay uh, i open this url in the same next tab yeah it's initially in the login page here i type abc at uh, initially i type wrong password and email it won't navigate to home page okay it's checking data is not saved in the local storage i type abc at gmail.com and also one two three four five is our password if i click login means it's navigate to home page okay the date email and password is stored in the local storage if i refresh this page yeah home page if i click logout means it's back to the whole sign in page if i refresh this page means yeah we get a sign in page sorry login page okay this is what i try to tell in this video bye bye